Good afternoon, Robert Scribbler, and part two of the Wellhouse review for keeping your electronic devices dry in the surf. So I went out uh, for a very brief surf session out here today off of Jeanette's Pier, and what I discovered is that um, I don't have enough cold weather protection. I go through the waves and boom, it just like freezes my brain and my hands go numb, my feet go numb. So <laughs> a 32 millimeter wetsuit is not enough um, without the heads, uh, the head protection, the heads, yeah, okay, my brain is clearly frozen. The head protection and the booties. But um, what does appear to have worked though is the Wellhouse uh, cell phone case uh, waterproofing device that I got this Christmas. Thank you, Eric and Martha Vinson. But uh, this is the moment of truth. I'm gonna take my Tesla key fob out and see if it is dry. So we're gonna open this bad boy up and take out the key fob. The outside of the case, of course, is wet because I went through the spin dry cycle a couple of times. But the key fob, perfectly dry. So, so it works well uh, in your pocket of your bathing suit while you're in your wetsuit while you're duck diving and uh, going through ice cold <laughs> swells there. So yes, the Tesla Model 3 key fob is a go after going through the spin dry cycle out here in the Wellhouse cell phone case <laughs> waterproofing device. God, my brain is not functioning. But yes, Wellhouse worked. It was a good job. Uh, dry key fob, thank goodness. Uh, otherwise, cat would kill me. Uh, myself, personally, very wet and <laughs> frozen brain. Ugh. Okay, next time we're going to get a hoodie and some booties and some gloves and try this thing again. Um, I did ride the retro rocket, but I didn't get any good, good waves, too frozen. Uh, we're going to try this again. Maybe this weekend, maybe we'll go south. But in any case, well house, good job. Thank you. Very good job. Very well done. All right. Thank you for joining me and I'll be back with you soon for a Friday for Future session.